We've reported extensively on just how difficult it is to get a COVID test. The lines have gotten longer as the Omicron spread has put even more strain on resources that were already slim. Now Mecklenburg County is hoping to cut down on those wait times with three new testing sites opened up by Mako Medical. WCNC Charlotte's Chloe Leshner live at one of the new locations. This one is in East Charlotte. So Chloe, has there been a lot of demand that you've seen there today? Hey, Carolyn, it was actually kind of strange. Now, this site did just close at 4 o'clock, but nobody's here to get a test, and it was pretty slow all day long. Now, that could be for a few reasons, including that people don't realize this resource is available yet. But we also went over to StarMed's location, which is usually packed full of cars, and they weren't busy there either. So now it raises the question if these new resources are too little too late. Just a few days ago, you were guaranteed to see this at a Mecklenburg County COVID testing site. Cars bumper to bumper, people waiting for hours. We went from testing 30,000 people a month to 130,000 people a month. Tuesday was the first time staff at Starman's Tuckasegee Road location could take a breather, just as three more sites opened around the county to relieve some of the pressure. We wish we had it a month ago. Mako Medical is up and running at the Park Expo, First Baptist Church of Cornelius, and R.C. Bradford Park in Huntersville. Between the three sites, they have the ability to test thousands of people a day. If it's easier for people, they're more likely to get tested um, and to reduce the wait times, take some of the pressure off the urgent cares and hospital systems in the area. Eric Christensen with Mako Medical says the first week at a new site is always hit or miss as people figure out the resource is available. But as cases begin to plateau and free at home testing kits are sent out by the federal government, demand for in person testing could start dropping off. The great thing about now is that we're in place. All the infrastructure here, um, everything's set up, uh, resources are available. Um, so if we need to slow thing down, things down for a little bit, it'll be that much easier if things do spike again uh, for us to get up and running within days instead of weeks. So for now, this site will be open Monday through Friday from 8 to 4, and you do not need an appointment. And we will just have to wait and see if today was a slow day or if demand really is starting to drop off for testing. Live in Charlotte, Chloe Leshner, WCNC Charlotte.